Hey, what's up everyone? John at the Geek here, and today I'm gonna to be removing the thermal grease from the CPU cooler as well as my CPU right there. And I'll be replacing it uh, with some uh, Arctic Silver 5 here. And before uh, I uh, apply all this, I have to remove it and I'll be using the uh, Arctic Clean, which is also made by the same people who make the Arctic Silver 5. Um, thermal material remover and uh, thermal surface purifier. Right? It's a two-step process. So uh, what I'll be using to actually clean them off is um, coffee filters, right? So it's a cheap, inexpensive, lint-free uh, solution. You can also use a, a microfiber cloth if you want or anything that's um, lint-free. And so, uh, and you don't also have to use this uh, thermal remover. Uh, you can use a high purity uh, isoprol uh, alcohol to clean this off. So, uh, um, and typically uh, you don't wanna kinda do this hanging over to your machine here, um, especially when you're doing dealing with this uh, cleaning liquid, but uh, I'm uh, just gonna go ahead and do it on the counter. I'm uh, sort of lazy and I don't wanna take apart everything, but I do suggest that you uh, um, don't do this uh, hanging over your computer here. Stuff could drip, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and clean that off. And uh, if you get it on your hands, um, dishwashing liquid will uh, clean this off. All right, so I'm just gonna do a little bit more here. And once you do clean this off, you're gonna wanna let it sit for a few minutes to sort of dry off, make sure everything dries off properly. And so uh, this is due to the fact that uh, when I did my case swap in another video, I uh, was lazy and I didn't even clean off the old thermal paste and I just added more thermal paste, which is a big no-no. You always wanna clean this off whenever you uh, take this apart. Um, and as a result of my laziness, my overclocking temperatures was ridiculously high. I was overclocking to 4.5 gigahertz and uh, it uh, reached 90 degrees, which is really bad and, uh, and dangerous. It's supposed to be, uh, shouldn't be more than 70 degrees if you're overclocking that high, seven degrees Celsius. Uh, when you're overclocking that high. So uh, now I'm gonna apply the uh, number two step here. Yeah, that's nice and clean. You really want to get this middle area here. That's going to be the part that actually touches the CPU. So there was a lot on this and there's still a lot on the CPU there as well. Again with the number one solution.
again with the number two compound same as the CPU cooler All right, so there we have it, a nice and clean CPU and CPU cooler. We're going to let this sit for about uh, five minutes to let the, uh, the surfaces air out and dry out. So we'll be right back to apply the uh, thermal paste. All right, so now I'm going to apply the uh, Arctic Silver 5. So go ahead and open this up. Right. Then I'm going to squeeze a very small amount, about uh, one millimeter by one millimeter by one millimeter, about the size of a small BB from a BB gun. Right, just like so. And uh, you're going to want to use a um, plastic card of some sort. I don't have one, so I'm just going to use this piece of plastic right here to uh, smear this around and so uh, use an old um, plastic card and try to spread this out to a very thin layer as much as you can And uh, don't worry if there's uh, some spots that are sort of missing because the uh, CPU cooler will um, dissipate the rest. Alright, so you're going to want to do a very thin amount. Try not to leave any clumps. All right, and that should be good. All right, so now I can go ahead and attach the uh, CPU cooler back on there. And uh, we'll check out the temperatures. Now, um, Arctic Silver 5, the company who makes this, uh, recommends that you um, have a break-in period of about 200 hours, roughly uh, two weeks of constant uh, use or a month of moderate use. So I'm not going to overclock this. I'm going to wait a couple of weeks before I overclock again and then uh, test the uh, temperatures. So uh, definitely check out the um, description to see uh, what my... my um, temperatures are 
And uh, thanks for watching. Johnny the Geek out. Peace.